Hey, welcome, welcome, welcome to Young Hustlers every Thursday, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We come to you here from Cardone Training Technologies to talk about your sales game. I got my favorite shirt on today, Cardone University, and I'm taking your phone calls. Ask me your sales question, 305-865-8668, 305-865-8668. We're talking about the young hustler. We're talking about keeping the hustle young in your sales game. And today we're talking about why you miss sales and how to quit missing sales. What's the title of today's show? Who knows that? How to save a deal, how to save a deal, how to save a deal, okay? First thing I look at in sales is how do I save the weekend, baby? How do I save the day? How do I save the hour? How do I save the statistic, okay? You've probably heard me say, set a target and never drop that target ever. We don't drop targets here, okay? I'm not a communist. I'm not the enemy and I ain't the devil. I got enough people pulling against me. I set a target, okay? If I set a target, if I'm honest with them, I don't lie to myself either, by the way, like a lot of you salespeople out there. You salespeople that lie to yourselves. You salespeople that are dishonest. You salespeople that are unethical. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about most of you. You set a target below your potential, you're unethical, right? You have this potential and you set your target here. Or you let somebody else set your target. You're a damn liar. Lying to your mama, your wife, your husband, your kids. Lying to yourself. All right? So how do you, what's the name of the show? Save the deal. How do you save your life? How do you save your potential? 305-865-8668. How do you keep your freaking, how do you keep it stiff? How do you keep it hard? How do you keep it freaking like, I'm, I'm excited. Look, man, you, if you keep doing this, you set a target. Your potential's up here. First question to ask yourself is this. What is your potential? What is the capability? What is the amount of quantity that's being sold? Is this even possible? If it's possible, then you move your target up to that potential, right? To lower that, to lower that is a lie to yourself. It's a criminal activity. It's like you're the damn Satan himself. So how do you save the deal, right? You should be saving deals every day. Every day you should be thinking about the deal you can save. I'm thinking about a deal right now that I did two days ago. I didn't close it. They went a different direction. I heard, I got word, not from the customer, but from his people around him. He's going in a different direction. What did I do as soon as I heard that? What should I do if I want to save the deal? I should make the call. If you want to save the deal, you got to get close. You got to close the distance between you and the no, right? You're taking notes right now. If there's a deal you want or a target you'd like to achieve or potential you'd like to reach, the only way to do that is to close the proximity between you and that target. Whether it's a customer, your potential, money, a girl, a guy, whatever, okay? Let's talk to a caller. We're talking to people on the phone that you, you, maybe your hustle got a little rusty. All right, you got Jordan. Maybe you got a little, like your oh. legs are a little stiff right now and you're not popping and hopping, okay? You got to close the proximity, close the proximity between you and the target. Go ahead, Jeff. What's his name? Jordan. My man. What's up, Jordan? Been waiting for your call. What's going on? Well, dude, I, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to inspire people. You know, I came into this show today. You didn't hear it, but I said, I am the greatest of all time, and I need to make sure everybody else knows it. And it sure is good to talk to you. Uh, and uh, you are quite the inspirational figure. Uh, but am I the greatest so, of all time? That's the question, Jordan. Yeah, absolutely. You're the greatest of all time, man. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Um, and I'm happy to be a part of your uh, movement. So... Uh, today, I, I really would like to talk about, uh, you know, when it's the right time to hire someone so that I can close the deal. I never have problems with closing the deal, but uh, how do I know? How do I know whenever I, it's okay to put everything towards hiring that person? Well, what 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 do you sell? What's your product? Um, well, it's called Look at That Media, and uh, I was a home inspector. Uh, marketing supervisor for the last 10 years and I took what real estate agents need to know and uh, sorry what real estate agents need to know for them or need to do for their marketing and I put it in a photography company 
and then I took that and put it into a social media company. Okay. <clears throat> So, so wh- 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 why, why are you, why are you like, are you, you want to hire some people? You want to do some expansion right now and you're worried about it? Uh, yes. Um, without a doubt. I mean, I've got more people, I've got people coming to me wanting more business. Um, yeah. And I, I just need to know, I'm just having a trouble with that hiring process. Yeah, yeah. No, well, dude, you, you, what you're having trouble with is your commitment. Like you said, you're a good closer, then you need to back it up with action. Right. You can't just like the next close is going to pay for that guy or a gal that you're going to hire. Don't even worry about it, bro. Just do it. Look, you guys that are have to think about stuff when you need to think, don't. That's what I do when I need to do something. I just don't think about it. I just start shooting stuff. Okay. if I think I need to fire my gun, I'm like, let's just start blowing rounds off. I, I got four clips with me right now. If I don't hit something, I'm going to scare somebody. <laughs> we're going to get something going. So when I don't know what to do, I do it. Okay. This is what keeps people small. They think thinking does not get you to do something. By the way, Jordan, let me just tell you this, man. I appreciate your call today. The person you hire probably is not going to work out anyway. You need to start thinking about hiring eight or 10 people. Don't even worry about one. Just bypass, skip, go into multiplication, not addition. My name's Grant Cardone and, and, and you, you in that place called Young Hustler, stay with us. We'll be right back. We're talking about save the deal. This will be our third fund. It's a $40 million fund. So we're giving people a chance now to say, hey, I want to be involved in big, big, giant real estate deals that pay money. These are deals that are doing anywhere from 160 to 200% returns. You put a million dollars into a deal and you're coming out with two, two to $3 million, but it's going to take 10 years. This is not get rich quick. Okay. If you're taking notes, write this down. Don't, don't do the get rich quick, man. Go for the get rich for sure. I don't need to get rich quick. I want to get rich for sure. So I'm going to go for 4,000 units. How many do you think I should go to? I'm going to go to 40,000 units. This is what I'm going to do, and this is why I'm going to do this. I'm going to go to 40,000 units, and I'm going to get the whole world involved in it. You're either going to invest with me, or you're going to actually help me raise these funds. Okay, so when you see me on social media talking about other stuff, anything that you see me talking about, what I'm doing is building an audience so I can allow people to get in a vehicle to where everybody gets rich. Let me tell you something. If you want to make happy customers for life, make them money. Are you ready to tap into the e-commerce revolution? Making $60,000 a day may seem unreal, but there is a proven method you can use to get there. It takes time, it takes dedication, it takes effort, and most of all, it takes resilience. Coach Gianni is now partnered with Gabriel Beltran, and together they are using the Ecom Millionaire formula to help increase your monthly revenue. Using his Ecom Millionaire system, you will sell products online, get step by step guidelines on how to market and use Facebook ads, and learn how to make millions with e commerce. As an official platinum sponsor of the 10X Growth Con, check out the MillionaireMastermind.com. That's the MillionaireMastermind.com. If you are a contractor in any industry, grow your business with access to our national app registry. Find jobs and be found by customers all across the United States. Increase your job intake and grow your business. Pro Service Finder was built with the customer and the contractor in mind. It is a simplified app to get you more business. Find the best clients, find the best contractors, no hassle, just straight business. Take care of your business and your home today. Sign up right now at ProServiceFinder.com. That's ProServiceFinder.com. 71% of Americans aren't saving enough for retirement. It's going to get worse as people live longer, and you need to start thinking differently. But you can't lose your time. Real estate is the investment vehicle that's made more ordinary people wealthy than anything else. Keith Weinhold of Get Rich Education is host of one of America's top investing shows, Disrupting Wall Street. He's an international best-selling author, a writer for Rich Dad Advisors, and has been an active income property investor since 2002. He has created thousands in passive monthly income for countless followers and now he has a free book, The Seven Principles for Creating Wealth in Your Life. Get your copy now at getricheducation.com forward slash book. That's getricheducation.com forward slash book. Because invest in what produces income for you now and later. Keith Weinhold is your guy. Sign up now at getricheducation.com forward slash book. Hey, welcome back to Young Hustlers. Grant Cardone here, greatest of all time. That's what they know me as in the sales space. If you're learning from anybody else in the sales space, folks, Stop what you're doing. Quit buying what you're buying. You don't need all these, 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 these guys teaching you all these tricks. You, selling is not steps. 
First of all, selling cannot be a step. Selling is a circle. Okay? That circle actually meshes together. It's not like I do this, and then I do this, and then I do this. If you're having to make steps, like we're not building a house here. I'm communicating with another human being. The communication goes best when it just flows. I don't want to have to think about their personality type. I got a deal right now. God didn't buy from me. What do I do to save the deal? That's all I care about. The easiest person to sell is somebody you didn't close. Okay? The easiest person to sell is somebody you already sold. Go get a second sale from them. You see me doing that all the time. The, the next easiest person to close is somebody that told you, no, we go in some other place. How do you do that? First thing you do to save the deal is close the proximity between you and the target. I don't need to go do an NLP course. Neuro-linguistic programming. God damn, just the name ought to tell you you don't need to be involved in it. Stupid, man. Let me go take a science class. All I got to do is pick up the phone and call the guy. Why didn't you buy from me, man? Okay, number one, close the proximity between you and the target. Number two, ask hard questions. Okay, I'm not checking personality types out, right? I'm not doing tonality. Hey, hey, Ed, why didn't you buy it from me? Who can't do that? This is what you did when you were a kid. Shit worked all the time. Why not, mama? Why not, mama? Mama would tell you, no, what'd you do? You go hug her leg. Close the proximity between you and mama. Mama, please, mama, please, mama, 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 please. Richard, Richard Pryor. Marlon, please. Marlon Brando, please. Come on, put it in me. Y'all didn't see that trending yesterday? Huh? My, my Marlon, please. Come on, Godfather. Make me an offer. I cannot refuse. First, close the proximity between you and the customer. Number two, ask hard questions. Okay, next caller. All right. Got Jordan in Las Vegas. Jordan in Vegas, baby. Am I going to see you at the 10X Growth Conference? Jordan, am I going to see you at the 10X Growth Conference in 15 days? Great. Hello. Great. Hello, my friend. How are you today? Hey, this is Jordan Harvey, Grant. My hey, man, J.H., I've been waiting to talk to you today, dude. Go ahead. What's going on? All right. So I got my process here. We, we did a one-on-one. -on -one. We talked about my intent statement. Mm. Going mm. into the fact-finding. Um. I'm going to just give you my intent statement. All right. So, hey, John and Joe, welcome to Blue Green. My name is Jordan. Thank you so much for coming in. I really appreciate your time. I don't want to waste it, so I'm going to get right into this as quickly as possible. Is that okay with you guys? Oh, that's great. Thank you. Great. So let me explain what we're going to do today. First, Please. we're going to go into a podium presentation. They're going to explain how the whole program works. Blue Green Resort are doing first-day incentives unheard of in the industry. So I'm going to pick you guys up take you on the tour of the property so you can see exactly what you're going to own today. Then I'll have my manager show you how much it costs, what the option that you feel works best for your well, no, Hey, hey, but Jordan, we're not buying anything. We're not buying anything today. I just did this. Hang on, man. I just want to let you know, man. I just, I, I just, I just did this because they gave me the free night. What do you mean? I just came in. I just, I don't, I'm not buying anything. I don't. Oh, I hear you, sir. I completely, I take full responsibility for that. I just wanted to show you my intention. Uh, okay, okay, go ahead. Awesome, awesome. So I'm going to pick you guys up. I'm going to have my manager show you the option that you feel works best for your family. So my intention when I sit down with couples like you guys is to get you guys on a plan in place so you can start going on vacation when you want, how you want, as often as you want, and saving you a lot of money. Okay, time out, time out, time out. So this is what I want you to do, man. You really took me out of the deal when you talked about the podium. Something about a podium presentation. Okay, so that's that's like how our how I, the work. I, I don't need to know about all that, bro. Okay, I get on a plane. Nobody right. tells me how, how it flies. We're going to open the flaps first. Then we're going to do this first. Dude, I just want to go to Vegas, dog. Get, get, the, uh, get the plane. I don't need to hear anything, bro. I don't care what it costs, the 10,000 gallons, uh, 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 the speed we're going to. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be going. Dude, dude, shut up. <laughs> Let me use my phone, man. I'm trying yeah. to tweet. You understand? So I don't need to hear about your manager or your podium presentation. You need to quit forewarning the situation. 
Like, you're not making a movie here. In a movie, hang on, hang on, listen to me, man. I am the greatest of all time. I have declared this to be the truth. Okay? Absolutely. Check it out, check it out. Don't, you're not making a movie. Don't forewarn your audience. Like, there's going to be a murder in the next scene. (laughs) And it's either him or him, okay? So what I want to do here is I just want to say, hey, appreciate you guys coming in. Don't want to waste your time. My goal, my intention here is to set you up on a plan where you can go on a vacation three times a year and save money. Does that interest you? No. Okay, good, good. How about this? You go on three vacations a year and you don't pay anything. Yeah, I like that. Now, that's what I'm talking about. I thought you would. I, I don't bring up the manager, dude. I don't bring up the tour. I don't bring up anything. Your intention right. is the close. Your intention is finishing the deal, right? Do I, I say that? Hey, my intention is to close you. No, no, you don't say that. You don't say you, you, my intention is to freaking slam dunk you, put, a, put you on a contract, and have you obligated to a bunch of debt. <laughs> Any more than you, you go out with a woman and say, hey, how about dinner? You know, you don't say, hey, how about a shower? (laughs) You could if you had a lot of swag. I mean, if you're on a roll and you were, you're like, no, you know. I had a girl tell me once, no way, no way. She's like, I'm not, no, 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 no. It all starts with a no, man. You know, you got yes and you got no. All you got to do is get to maybe, baby, and we're going to take a shower. (laughs) Absolutely. We get to maybe, man. I guarantee you she's going to be wearing my pajamas tonight. Young hustlers, young hustlers, I'm trying to keep your freaking thing, you tight. Oh, yeah. You got to get your pitch tight. You got to get your pitch fresh. This dude calling right now, Jordan. Jordan, did you get your tickets for the growth conference yet? Grant, I got VIP tickets. My man, my man, follow Jordan. I'm going to be pitching you at the conference because I want a work to work for you. Let's go. I sent in two videos. Let's go. I'm ready to go, man. Let's go. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Go. I love you, dude. I love you. Appreciate you calling. Folks, you're watching Young Hustlers today, okay? 305-865-8668. In the last section, I'll take your phone calls. Don't you go nowhere. We're going to get that hustle tight. Nico's Computer Engineering is at the front of everything digital and technology. With the most advanced use of Amazon Web Services, artificial intelligence to predict your next sale, learn how to predict what your customers will buy next, learn how to know and automate your whole business so you can do one thing, go make more money. Tim Clark is the guy to know, a thriving entrepreneur and the mastermind behind artificial intelligence sales processes. Get automated, make more money, and grow your business with Nico's. Learn more at NicoCE.com. That's NicoCE.com right now. Bullfrog is here for 2018 to service you and your business to the highest levels of success. More communication, no drop calls, better integration, faster response time. Kill the desk phone and take your office mobile. Sign up for a free trial right now at Bullfrog.net. That's Bullfrog.net and join the world's number one telecommunications company, Bullfrog.net. Or email Ben at bullfrog.net or benrife at gmail.com. Email Ben at bullfrog.net or benrife at gmail.com. Franchising is listed by Grant Cardone as one of the ways to become a millionaire. Let the experts at Fran Finders be with you every step of the way as your partner finding, buying, selling, and promoting franchises. With over 10 years experience, Fran Finders is the company to help get set up with franchising, to help you get set up with owning your own franchise and finding a franchise that's right for you. Visit FranFinders.com. That's FranFinders.com to get started with your search today. This will be our third fund. It's a $40 million fund. So we're giving people a chance now to say, hey, I want to be involved in big, big, giant real estate deals. They pay money. These are deals that are doing anywhere from 160 to 200% returns. You put a million dollars into a deal and you're coming out with two, two to three million dollars, but it's gonna take 10 years. This is not get rich quick, okay? If you're taking notes, write this down. Don't, don't do the get rich quick, man. Go for the get rich for sure. I don't need to get rich quick. I wanna get rich for sure. So I'm gonna go from 4,000 units. How many do you think I should go to? I'm gonna go to 40,000 units. This is what I'm going to do, and this is why I'm going to do this. I'm going to go to 40,000 units, and I'm going to get the whole world involved in it. You're either going to invest with me, or you're going to actually help me raise these funds. Okay, so when you see me on social media talking about other stuff, anything that you see me talking about, what I'm doing is building an audience so I can allow people to get in a vehicle to where everybody gets rich.
Because let me tell you something, if you want to make happy customers for life, make them money. Hey, Grant Cardone, welcome back to Young Hustlers. Jared's taking the day off. What a slacker he is, little Mr. Pasty. And I'm here to tell you the greatest of all time is talking the sales game with you folks. Drop the tricks. I'm telling you the tricks are killing you guys. You're overthinking the sales game. How do you close a deal? First, you pick the people that you know will buy from you, the people you can lean on, mommy, daddy, uncle, aunt. If you can't sell your friends and your family, man, how are you going to sell somebody you don't know? I expect my brothers and my sisters to buy from me. I lean on them. I use it all, man. I, do, I just go back to when I was a kid, man. Like, mama, 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 remember that. What'd you do? Close the proximity and beg if you got to. Don't quit. Keep asking, okay? Number one, close the proximity to the deal. Number two, ask the hard questions. Why not? Why not? Why not, mama? Why not, mama? Why not, mama? You don't have to go to a class for this. Shit. Mama will be like, God damn it, take it. Here's two of them. Shall leave me alone. You want a bicycle and a puppy? I'll give them both to you. Okay, go beat your sister up for a while. Leave me the hell alone. Like, like you got what happened, man? You guys, this is not complicated. Anybody pitching more than that? Right? I got a client. He didn't do the deal with me. I called him up. Hey, he didn't take the call. I left the message. Then I text him. I'm calling him again today. Hey, you didn't call me back, man. I understand you're going in a different direction. Why did you do that? Why'd you do that? Why didn't you do business with me? What can we do to play? I want to play with you, okay? If not now, next week, not next week, next month. If not next month, next year, when can we play, man? And then I got to go, if that doesn't work on the phone, I got to go crawl up all in his neighborhood. How do you save a deal? You save a deal because you quit lowering your targets. If your target's up here, you do not lower the target. You increase the activity. How do you take over a village? How do you rule the world? How do you take care of your family? Close the proximity between you and the target. Okay, increase the activity. Let's talk to the next caller. Young Hustlers. By the way, if you guys aren't on the Cardone University, we don't motivate, vote, motivate people there. We tell people what to say there. What to say, how to act what to do on the call, what to do in the email, what to do in the Facebook campaign, how to pitch, promote, handle objections, and ultimately is why Cardone University is the number one sales training system in the world. And Jordan Belfort would like to say his is, but you know it's not. Come on, Jordan. Quit lying to people, man. You already freaking took advantage of a bunch of people. You don't need to keep lying to people after you took advantage of them. Ooh. Please, man, come on. Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon. Go ahead. Charles in Mississippi, what's up, man? Hey, Grant, how are you doing today? Good, man, good. Man, the reason I'm calling today is uh, my 14-year-old daughter and I, we, uh, we come across your material back in August of 2017. Um, and I kind of have a similar story as you. I'm a recovery. I've been sober now seven years, and I've been sober on alcohol for three years. But my, my question is, is how do I get, when, when you were back then, when you, you were just getting, you know, started, how do I get people to see the new me versus the old me, what they see on paperwork? Well, how, well, how do I, I, I've been in sales all my life. I've been, I've been, I, I first started out selling sugar cane at 13 years old. And sugar I've what? been, you know, I went through a dark era uh, in my 20s and <clears throat> About 28 years old, I moved up to Mississippi from Jacksonville, Florida to change my life. And I did. I did a complete 180. I became a new person, and, you know, I started following you. And when I did, it was like a rocket got strapped to the back of my butt. I got the millionaire book, and, I mean, dude, it has completely changed my life, as well as my 14-year-old daughter who's sitting right here next to me who can hear everything you're saying. Dude, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. Uh, and, and tell her hello for me. So, number one, I would just tell you, don't even worry about the past, man. You're, you're thinking about it. Nobody else is. Okay. No, nobody well, else well, is. But, but, but you got people ask you questions. They don't even know the question they ask you. I guarantee you right. half the audience doesn't even know what food they ate this morning for breakfast. <laughs> so right. so, so I, I wouldn't even worry about it, dude. I, like, I don't even think about yesterday anymore. I just keep moving forward. I, keep, I create light. I create light in front of me. I'm like, success. 
pe people underestimate the value of success. The value of success is that people look to it. They, they, they move to it. Like, and some people move to the darkness, right? So the last yeah. thing you want to do is talk about the car wreck. Have you ever had a car wreck? Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, if you remember it while you're driving, you're going to have another one. Yeah. yeah you spend yeah, enough yeah, time yeah. on the car wreck you had when you were a kid? I've been in two head-on crashes when I was a kid. I'm head-on. I'm talking about total of every vehicle. 1966 Mustang hits two chicks, three chicks in a car. Everybody in their car. Both cars totaled to, 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 <laughs> to complete 100% demolition, demolition value, okay? I walked wow. out of the car. I wasn't even hurt. I got out. I'm like, somebody want to go home with me? <laughs> jaws all well, broken i'm like i ain't taking like her that's, that's, okay that's, that's but check it out 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 i got in another wreck i got in another wreck head on brand new trans am i hit a suburban three people in the suburban everybody broke up i got out of the thing with a bump on my head still got the bump on my head oh, today wow. both cars completely zero value totaled all right now the point i'm making them is this when i drive down the street today i don't think about those two accidents yeah. If I do, I'm going to have another head on. So mm -hmm. don't worry about it, bro. You, like you opening, okay. you opening with the recovery thing. You need to drop it, man. Okay. All By right. the way, All I right. want you well, to call Katie. I want to turn you on to something. I want you to call Katie. All you guys have had any kind of a drug history. You're not going to get, you, when you stop drugs, the drugs don't stop. You need to know that. Drugs are stored in the body. Yeah. And they send messages so mm -hmm. I, w I, was, I, I didn't have any drugs in my body for 20, let me see, 25 to 50, 25 years. No drugs in my body. I did this, this purification process, okay? And the drugs were still in my body after 25 years, and I didn't have any drugs in my body. I experienced wow. every drug I had ever taken, which means what I'm saying to you is when you stop drugs, the drugs that you did, they still go. So there's yeah. little residuals of those drugs and all the experiences and the highs and the lows and the depression and the, all the craziness are still stored in your body. So talk to Katie. She's going to turn you on to something I did 20, uh, about 15 years ago that, to save my Took my life to another level. Tell your daughter hello, man. Thanks for calling in. Folks, this is Young Hustlers. I'm talking about saving deals. How do you save deals? Get out of the past and into action. Okay? Here's the target. Close the proximity of the target. Ask hard questions. What are hard questions? Why didn't you do it? Why didn't you buy from me? What can I do to save the deal? How could I save the deal? Okay. What else could I do? And then don't stop doing that. You guys need to have as a target people complaining about, why are you calling me so much? You got to quit calling me. Most of you never hear that. You never hear, take me off the list. You don't get unsubscribed. We do. Some of you watching right now, you've unsubscribed from me twice and you still came back because I found you some other place. Which brings me to the last point. You have to stay top of mind. Stop top of mind. Even when you lose the deal, you have to stay like breaking news. You can unsubscribe from my newsletter. I'm still going to find you somewhere. Just because you killed one route, you cut it off. Don't call me anymore. Just because you block your phone number, I'm going to find you some other place, man. <laughs> Back door, front door, window, vacation, Facebook, Instagram. Boops, there he is again. I'm going to retarget you. You're going to wander back into my website one day. Bang, I'm going to drop a cookie up on all on you. I'm going to put a Richard Pryor on a Marlon Brando. I'm going to put a cookie on your website. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, everybody be Googling Richard Pryor and, and Marlon Brando right now, okay? Okay, next caller. Uh, Mario. Mario, Mario, Mario. Mario Puzo. What's popping, Uncle G? What's popping is the popcorn, dog. You already know, baby. Listen, Uncle G, I got a quick question for you. Bring it. I got a, I got a little bit of a problem with uh, just, just being able to close. Uh, realistically, just getting a client to say yeah or getting them to return call. What do you What do you think? What are your most effective tips that you have for, for something like that? Number one, ask for the close. Like, do ask you do you close. even That's ask? Do you do you even ask for the close? Oh, absolutely. What I do here, let me explain to you a little bit about this. I'm a contractor, so a lot of these times you're not necessarily. Uh, a hundred dollar item that they can buy. It's, it's all going to be, you know, everything that we do is, is you're dealing in a thousand. Oh yeah. Everything sure you, you do is real you complicated. With large amounts of, uh, huge, of, 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 you know, large, large. Yeah. 
thing yeah. is, so like, like for example, let's just say you were a client. I tell you, you know what? Let's let's close. I want to know. You know, if you're going to tell me no, I want to know why you're telling me no. I don't think want you to tell me no. Um, why am I having such a problem sometimes closing with with, with people? Well, 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 I don't know, dude. I, I guarantee you the number one problem you're having is you don't even ask for the close. Now, you're going to tell me you do, but I'm going to tell you you don't. And by the way, I am the greatest of all time, so I know what the hell I'm talking about. You really are. That's, that, that's why I'm on the phone with you. So, so I'm telling you right now, the number one reason you guys don't close deals is because y'all never ask. I had a professional salesperson sitting here with me yesterday, told me, see, Grant, I just asked for your business. I said, no, you didn't do. You said... You said, you suggested that one day I might buy insurance from you. That's like a grazing. Okay. That's, like, like, that's like, like you scratch my car. You scratch my car, you didn't get me. That's not a wreck, okay? Right? You, 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 you okay. know, you talked about going out with me. Doesn't mean we woke up together. You don't I even. I got you, I got you. You, you, got, you guys think that you show somebody something. Yeah, the price is, and this is what we do, and, and. Y'all, y'all do all this stuff here, man. Like I just do. I, I just like. Okay. Hey, buy it. <laughs> buy well, that's it. That's the thing. Like we, we deal with a lot with concrete. A lot, a lot of the stuff we deal with is concrete. So what, 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 wait, wait, wait. Listen to me, man. Well, listen to me, man. Listen to me, man. You, why don't you ask people to buy the product before you even present it? Huh? I never really thought about that. <laughs> why do you think you have to present it? Don't you think there's some people that just uh, want to buy your product? There's got to be some percentage. Somebody calls Johnny. Johnny, can you shoot my camera? Can you shoot my, my wedding or whatever, right? Johnny's like, yeah, well, let me check, and I got to check, and I got to do this. Dude, why don't you, Johnny, yeah, yeah, man, send me a check for 5800 Well, are you available? I don't know. Send me a check for 5800 and then I'll figure it out, right? So, like, like, I'm at Home Depot. I'm like, hey, do you have this or that? How many can I get you? Just go for the clothes, man. Just ask how many. Ask right away. How many can I give you? With certainty, just you could. You could. What are they going to say? Well, <laughs> I need to know the difference between the cypress and the red one. Is what you're saying. You, you tell that you're buying these many from me. How many? And I've seen you do it. I've seen you well, do it with books and stuff before. Uh, I think that's brilliant. I just never. You know, it's hard to execute. It's not easy. Have you seen? It's, it's not hard to execute, dude. It's not hard to execute. It's not hard to execute. Okay. I, I'm at the dentist. Thinking about it at the minute. The dentist tells me the root canal is going to be, you know, four thousand dollars. All right. He's wow. not asking you. He's telling you. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's a lot of money. Four grand for a root canal. Yeah. You want to think about it? Uh, not really. I really don't want to think about really. it at all, dude. We got to get it done, baby. We got to get it done. I want to get in my car and go home. That's what I want to do. By the way, it's got nothing to do with the four grand. It's got something to do with the idea that you're going to have a canal in my roots. Let me talk to the next caller, oh, man. Gee, hey, dude, start asking for the clothes, dog. Quit being a little bitch. Start asking for the bit, bit, business. Start leaning on people, man. Your business is not complicated. All you guys out there think, oh, my business is different. Really? Your business isn't any different. You're selling finance, financial services, insurance, real estate, okay? You're selling bottles. You're selling water. You're selling multi level marketing. You're selling hope. You're selling a dream. You're selling a vote. You're selling charity. It isn't any different, folks. I've sold, I've given money away. Giving money away can be hard, as hard as getting people to give you money. Do you still got to ask for the clothes? Period. Okay. Julio, Julio, what you got going on, yo? How are you, Grant? Come on, man. Bring it on. Bring your question, dog. Hey, man. So I've been following you for a long time. I've read the 10X Rule, Sell It Be Sold, Be Obsessed with the Average. I've seen your TV hiring shows. And uh, you actually contributed to helping me kind of find my vision and uh, dropping out of college, even though my parents are both teachers with their masters. Uh, I started my business in uh, California. We're a tent and uh, protective film company. So we do uh, clear bra and paint protection films and vehicle wraps and also automotive tents. My question for you is how do we make sure this is our first full year as a, as a business here in my hometown. How do we make sure that we get as much money in the door as possible? Uh, so, I feel so, like I've set up my yeah. business marketing properly, like my branding yeah. and my sales room is, is amazing with our heat lamps and our examples and our, and our overall uh, strategy to sell is good. We have financing, so 101 days, no interest. So we, we can sell anything from 200 
all the way to $600 jobs, all the way to $2,500 jobs. So how do we make sure that we just get the most out of this year in our sales department? Yeah, dude, look, look, look you, you're asking a great question, okay? This is a simple question. Focus on the sale. Focus on closing the deal. Focus on the follow-up. Yeah. Focus on the sale. Focus on the follow-up. Focus on the close. Focus on the sale. Like the only thing y'all should be talking about, I don't know about all the heat lamps and all that thing, but hey, who am I on the phone? Am I talking to somebody? Am I asking for the money? Am I closing the proximity between me and the target? Press your people, push your people, keep pushing. Keep talking about the successes, sell the product, close the deal. How do you make a happy customer? Close the deal. My unhappiest customers are people that never became my customers, period. It's not people complaining, oh, I didn't get this and I didn't get that and you didn't do this and I got to have that. Dude, it's the people that didn't buy from me are the most disappointed are the customers with the least satisfaction, okay? That's the ones yeah. I worry about. Hey, thanks for watching Young Hustlers today, folks. Every day, by the way, we're going to spend one whole day in Vegas talking to uh, seven people are going to come on stage one day talking about how important it is what I just said. How do you do it in the advertising business? How do you do it in the, uh, in the protein business, in the, in the self-help business? How do you do it in the coaching business? How do you do it in the real estate business? I got people going to be, in, how do you do it in the healthcare business? $35 billion worth of sales just from the people that speak on day one at the 10X Growth Conference. If you haven't gotten your recording yet, we got about 12 hours left maybe 13 hours left for you to get it at the special and then it goes away. So that's today. It ends today. Put it off. I guarantee you, you will never see it there again at that offer. It's grantcardone.com forward slash. Is that right? Or 10xgrowthcon.com? It's grantcardone.com forward slash. I don't think you know, man. 10xgrowthcon.com forward slash stream if you want to grab that. If you... If you, if you, let me just give you this one notice, okay? If you're watching this on iTunes or listening on iTunes, please, please, please do me a favor. I'm trying to hit number one, number two right now on the iTunes under sales shows. Subscribe to the channel if you liked it. Please like, like it. Say something good about it. Give me some love, man. Give me some love. Give me some love. I'm begging you. Give me some love. I'm holding on to your leg right now. Please, please, please subscribe to me. Please, please. Come on. Come on. Give me some love. Okay. The other thing is this, all right? What? You don't know, man. You don't know. If you haven't bought your ticket to the growth conference and you're hitting the website right now and you can't get a seat and you're a good friend of mine or you're an old client of mine, you call Natalie and say, hey, I'm a friend of the G. See what you can do <laughs> and watch what happened. 305. No, no. Our number here is 310 7702 Double five three one zero seven 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 zero two five five. I'll see you guys tomorrow in the Cardone Zone. This will be our third fund. It's a $40 million fund. So we're giving people a chance now to say, hey, I want to be involved in big, big, giant real estate deals that pay money. These are deals that are doing anywhere from 160 to 200% returns. You put a million dollars into a deal and you're coming out with two, two to $3 million, but it's going to take 10 years. This is not get rich quick. Okay? If you're taking notes, write this down. Don't, don't do the get rich quick, man. Go for the get rich for sure. I don't need to get rich quick. I want to get rich for sure. So I'm going to go from 4,000 units. How many do you think I should go to? I'm going to go to 40,000 units. This is what I'm going to do, and this is why I'm going to do this. I'm going to go to 40,000 units, and I'm going to get the whole world involved in it. You're either going to invest with me, or you're going to actually help me raise these funds. Okay, so when you see me on social media talking about other stuff, anything that you see me talking about, what I'm doing is building an audience so I can allow people to get in a vehicle to where everybody gets rich. Because let me tell you something, if you want to make happy customers for life, make them money.